Now the next topic that is magnetization and magnetic intensity. Now magnetization of any substance or any sample means what? Magnetization of any sample that is nothing but the net magnetic moment of that sample per unit volume. Suppose net magnetic moment of given sample that is M net and its total volume is V, then M net upon V that is the net magnetic moment of the sample per unit volume and that is called its magnetization. Its unit that is ampere per meter. You can write the dimensional formula that is M0 L minus 1 T0 A1. Now, if we consider a solenoid having n tons per unit length, which one is carrying current I. Then in previous chapter, we studied this thing, the magnetic field inside it that is given by B0, that is mu0 n I. Now, mu0 here appears, that is the permeability of free space because at present inside the solenoid the air is there we can say that is the free space so core core of the solenoid that is the free space so here we take the permeability of free space now n into i that is called h that is magnetic intensity. Now, N that is number of turns per unit length, I that is current through each turn. So N into I will give you total current per unit length of the solenoid. And that is magnetic intensity. So its unit that will be also ampere per meter. It implies that Inside the solenoid, if core part, that is the free space or air, then the magnetic field, that is mu zero into H, where mu zero, that is the permeability of that core part, which is the free space. Clear to all of you?